Hey everyone, welcome. Today we'll be looking at how to finish up your grades at the end of a quarter, and this will be principally targeted to elementary teachers. So as you can see, I've opened a file here. This would be my fourth grade ELA class. Once I'm here, um, what I need to do is click on grading if I have my grades finished. Now this is a fake class, so I only have one assignment, but you can see the idea. So I click on grading, and I'm going to choose grade done, grades done for term two. From here, I'll close that one, and I'm just going to proceed down the list until I get to this last one that has the little house by it. Now, this is my home room, and I want to do that last no matter where it appears in the list. So I'll come now to this one, Math 5th. We'll just work our way down, as I was saying. Um, with each class, we'll go to Grading and say Grading Done for Term 2. Click on OK again. Again, proceeding down the list. I want to get to the one that has the house by it, my homeroom, last. Okay, so we'll cover this one. Again, also grading, grades done for term two. Move on until we get to that last one. We're gradually just working our way down. Last one, of course, being homeroom. That's the one that aggregates all of these grades together with me as the instructor. So grading, we'll say grades are done here. Now we're coming up to our final class, which will be that homeroom. Again, if it's not your last one, be sure to open it last after all the other subjects have had their grading completed button clicked. So now here we can say grading is done. And this time we'll see a completely different window. So for this one, because it's homeroom, it just has those students in it, even though I have other students in the other classes. But I can click on each student and review uh, grades. Okay, and so that gives me a chance to sort of look over how the students have done. You can see basically we haven't done any of those things because this is a fake class. But if I saw that this student had a goal, a grade that didn't seem to be correct or uh, seemed to be lower than it needed to be or higher than it needed to be for that matter, I can double click on that, come down here and change the grade that it should be, and then click Apply Change. And then that will appear in red to be the override. Once I've completed all of my review here to see that the students have accomplished everything they should, I go through each student to make sure their grading is set the way it should be. Uh, if I did have academic grades, they would appear over here. These, of course, being personal and social responsibility. Uh, check on memos also, but when I have everything done, I just click on the grading done box and that will submit those grades for finalization for this quarter. Well, I hope that was useful and that you got some info out of it you needed, or if it's a quick review for you, I hope it was sufficient. Meanwhile, have a great day.